How's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. So today I'm doing an empties video. So if you guys would like to stick around and go through my trash, keep on watching. So let's get right into this and see what products I've gone through and I'll let you know if, you know, yeah, I'll repurchase it or if it's just a no. You guys already know I repurchased my Soap and Glory Vitamin C Facial Wash. I love this stuff and I did repurchase it so I already have my backup of that. I did use up this. Uh, it's from the Creme Shop. It's charcoal and lemonade. They're the sheet masks that I got in TJ Maxx. Really liked these. I went to look to see if they had any when I was in TJ Maxx not long ago and sadly they did not but I did pick up other ones so we'll be trying some different ones out. Another sheet mask. It's by nature avocado oil and rice protein recharging face mask. This was really nice. A lot of the by nature that you can get in Walmart buy two for a certain price. Two for five maybe is that what they are? But they're that that's really nice. Another one I have here, oh my gosh, I loved this one. It's by nature, it's the Pumpkin and Spiced Cha Latte Brightening Face Mask. Yes, this was lovely. Oh my goodness, I can still smell it. If you love the smell of pumpkin chai or anything like that, yeah, this, this would be your mask too. And if you want brightening also, love that. Went through my Dickinson's uh, Original Witch Hazel Daily Refreshing Cleansing Cloths. Love these. Definitely would repurchase these. I got them in my Rite Aid. Uh, the Retinol Makeup Cleansing Wipes. Um, I got this in the Dollar Tree. No, I would not repurchase these. I did not like either one of them. I got a Retinol and a Collagen one. This one here really just messed me up. It um, got my skin too dry. And I mean, I use Retinol and other stuff, so I'm not sure, but this just, no. I used them more for when I did um, swatches on my hands or something like that and that's how I've been using them up anyway but I won't repurchase those. Um, oh okay so Soap and Glory another one it's the Rich and Fomus body wash yes would repurchase this I already have the other one I'm using right now and this one I really like it has a nice vanilla like warm vanilla scent oh my goodness I love that and it, it's really nice the other one though I think is my favorite I forgot the name of it right now but it smells a lot like uh, pure grace line from philosophy it smells like the inner grace if you ever tried inner grace but this one here has more of the warm vanilla if you like warm vanilla scents you would like the uh, rich and famous one <laughs> I, I like that one too it is nice Oh, I went through this. This is really nice too. Uh, the Olay Moisture Ribbons Plus. This had um, Shea and Manuka Honey, which you know I like a lot of stuff with Manuka Honey already. This was really good too and it smelled really nice. So yes, I would purchase it again. Uh, I used my Neutrogena Deep Clean Purifying 100% Hydrogel Mask. It has seaweed extract in it. And these are really nice. This is the only one I've tried so far, and I really did like that one. So I would probably repurchase that one. Went through my Tarts, uh, Tarts Lights Camera Lashes Mascara, which you guys know I really liked this. I like this mascara. The only thing was towards the end, I couldn't use it anymore. The, um, you know, the, the thing that's supposed to help um, take the excess off the thing that's in there that takes the excess uh, mascara off is broken in there or something so that kind of made it even more of a hot mess but I felt like it was time to go ahead and get rid of it anyway because I've been using it for a while now I, I got that a good while back ago uh, used my uh, soft soap ginger cookie hand wash so when this does come back out around Christmas time, obviously, I would get that again. It was, yeah, it smelled really nice. My Too Faced Hangover, or the Hangover X primer, I really do like this primer. So I would purchase this again at some point if if I feel, because it is really nice and it is silicone free. I do like that one a lot. Canteen Dry Shampoo Blowout Extend Dry Shampoo. I got this a while back ago. I'm getting rid of it because I've had it for a while and I don't like I don't like dry shampoos. Every dry shampoo I've tried so far, I have not liked. I don't, I just don't like them. They're 
they're, they just aren't good for my hair. I don't think my hair likes them. I think I'm just not even going to bother buying anything that says dry shampoo. You might as well forget it. I just not, I'm not going to try it or even buy it because I just, I'm at the point now where I just don't like any dry shampoo. So, and my hair does fine without dry shampoo anyway. So that maybe that's why too. I don't know. Maybe I don't really need it. Okay. This is <laughs> the squeezed squeeze the heck out of this thing dove go fresh this one's uh cool, cool moisture body wash uh cucumber and green tea scent yes loved it so i'd of course buy it again for sure oh i wish i wish i could find this product here it is the got to be kinkier double curling power gloss and define curl cream this is the curl cream that i really like from got to be i like the mousse and the curl cream do not like the spray gel but this I cannot find anywhere. It's just like a no find. Um, my secret Paris Rose went through this. I like I like the secret uh, deodorant, especially the gel ones. I like those ones a lot. So I'll go through them a good bit. Uh, Bryo G is how you pronounce that. Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. This is a really good deep conditioning mask. They're pretty pricey, but it is a really nice deep conditioning mask. I got that in my Boxy Charm, and I really liked that. Oh, I already got my backup, which I've been going through it now, and I'll have to get another one here soon. But the Aster Woods Matrixel 3000 Argylene Vitamin C. I'm telling you what, this is an amazing product. I love this one. I, I do. I, this is one thing that I feel is so good for my skin. I really love that. And... I already repurchased another one and been going through it. And then I have uh, from uh, Obagi the Zo Skin Health Obagi. This is from the Zio line. This is his um, Growth Factor Serum Plus. Loved this stuff. I mean, I went to the very end where there was nothing left in that. I mean, I opened up the lid and everything because it was one of those ones where you uh, pumped out, pushed out through here loved this stuff it was a thick serum it's pricey but boy am i tempted to go ahead and get it anyway because i really liked it what it did for my skin and i believe that's it yeah that's everything that's the trash so anyway guys if you liked going through my trash my garbage like just give me a thumbs up and let me know if you do and you like these kind of videos some do some don't and so that's fine you know I get you because I really didn't watch a lot of them myself neither for a while there I mean it was like an on and off thing for myself but then you realize it is kind of interesting because you want to see what people go through and get an idea of what they might like and or love so yeah let me know let me let me know and give me a thumbs up and also share my video that would help out so much too to get me out around there if you are not subscribed to my channel i'd love to have you go ahead and click the subscribe button that's down below over here yeah over here also make sure you hit the bell that's right next to it if you hit the bell it will notify you by email of when my videos are uploaded and ready to watch so i would love to have you can keep connected see what's going on see what i'm getting rid of what's going in my trash and as always beauties please remember to be yourself love yourself and let the real beauty shine through so until the next time you take care Bye. We'll see you then. I love you guys. Bye.